minimizing charisma, maximizing intelligence, shooting someone in the crotch with a cannonball, thrust, propulsion, it's sciency. <laughs> Why you always gotta be blowing my spot up like that? There are my runes. There they are. I'm not mad. Science needs art and art needs science. They both need each other to function properly. There are ways to figure out what the paper is really saying. And then I'm ready to get on Twitter and yell at people about doing their own research on the- oh! Oh, oh, hold on there, sports fan. Kyle Hill, everybody, is the next generation of science communicator. I'm going to be too old at a certain point to do those terrible things to my body, and it'll be up to you. He's got like a lion. This guy's amazing. <laughs> Kyle Hill. I'm Boo Rambo. The universe is indifferent to you. Whether or not you have amazing hair, the universe doesn't care. How are trees pushing past this pressure limit? Ah! Behold, my balls. Ah! Now we're getting somewhere, but I still don't think it's worthy of G.R.R. Martin suspender. I'm totally right, right? Oops up photos of my my frickin' hair? Is that what you all want? No, you don't, weirdos. Kyle Hill. Is your last name actually Hemsworth? What's going on? Our, our resident Thor no. lookalike. I prefer uh, Black Friday Chris Hemsworth. Oh, thank you. Hey, you know, if you need a haircut. No, of course not. We're not gonna send sharks with frickin' laser beams on their heads to an asteroid. We're gonna nuke. You don't need Bruce Willis at all. <laughs> Wrenched. Oh! oh! Headshot! Oh! Kevin, turn on the monitor. Kevin, this transition better work. The blast doors can't. Kevin, turn it on. Ke Kevin. Hey, Kevin, call his agent and have them call my agent. Kyle Hill. Happy birthday. Feliz Navidad. I'm just a biologist. I don't know how this works. This is how you do science. Can I just grab it? Oh. Laws. Corollaries. <laughs> <laughs> I know that global catastrophe isn't the most fun thing to think about all day unless you're me, so... Are we gonna do some science, bro? <laughs> Lasers don't have that much momentum. That's not how a clockwise works. <laughs> Don't worry, you can do this even if you are not an AI. It boots the boundary layer around a person through identity. And I guess it matters what kind of dragon we're talking about. realize here is that the big of the thing does This kite is completely inaccurate. I'm gonna kill this guy and tell him to his face. You're wrong about physics. Not enough lift force. Oh. Nuclear metal donut thing with magnetically confined star-like plasma. The radiation flux in here alone is enough to cause instant death. That's really funny. I like that idea. Hey, look at me. I'm a streamer. I have a bedroom. We know anything with a decapitation hazard deserves to, uh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh that's good. Oh. That's fine. Put it on PBS. I dare you. Jet, I simply must come clean with you. In the last stream, Scientist Plays, I said that I will be trying my hardest not to uninstall Elden Ring. Many of you said, Kyle, just give it some more time. It will grow on you, much like your glorious hair glows, uh, grows on your head. And I said, nay. Well, Chad, I went back over the last week. And if we put three hours into the last stream, I have put over 25 hours into Elden Ring off stream. I'm in. I'm hooked. You were right. You got me. Chad, you were right and you got me. So, in honor of all of you, Chadith and Taylor Thomas, being correct and me being wrong, we are jumping back in to Elden Ring for today's Scientist Plays. What is Scientist Plays? I'll tell you. Scientist Plays is the only place on the whole dang internet where you can get a certified science boy to play some of your favorite games, sciencing them as we play them pretty good. 
Why? Well, hi, I'm Kyle. In addition to being a scienceman, in addition to having an entire facility where we explore and explain everything underneath the stars and beyond, I'm also a gamer. And so, we will be playing through some of your favorite games. We've played through Half-Life 2, Sekiro, Fallout 4, Dead Space, Dead Space 2. We'll be playing through Dead Space Remake. We'll be playing Atomic Heart. We'll, we'll be playing Diablo 4. But today, the mission is to bring you inside here at the facility and try to science the crap out of, I'll admit it, a pretty sick game. I got pretty far in it. I mean, I, I did a lot of work while we were off stream. So, uh, I'll, ever, I'll let everyone know. Hey, we'll, we'll get into it. We'll get into how much work we did. TJ, Captain, Tactical, Chompy, Chef, Nicholas, 2 and 4, Lord Elrond was there 3,000 years ago. Buster Sharp, welcome. Usually our resident science timekeeper, we'll see. Uh, Tesla Kuehl, Verns, Dark Jester, James, Brenby. Uh, as you can see, I've added a new AI to the chat. So if you are timed out or something like that, uh, basically, this new AI Kevin model, GPT 3 PT G3, uh, its job is just to spam links at you. So if you see that, don't worry about it. I know about it. Darkstalker, Serene, welcome, 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 welcome. Fettimano! What is the best game you've ever played, Kyle? Depends. As I said last stream when I was saying how Elden Ring is bad and I was wrong, I prefer narrative-driven single-player experiences that I can really delve into that really hit me in an emotional way or, or at least change my thinking or, or just impress upon me a very memorable experience. So for that, I will say The Last of Us Part 1 and Part 2 are probably the best games in that respect that I've played. Um, Red Dead Redemption 2 is up there. Uh... God of War 1 and 2, very high up there. Those are those are like my top three. Um, but in terms of like the most fun game that I've ever played, I don't think that I've ever said out loud so many times something like, wow, or ha ha, more than playing Super Mario Odyssey. Um, Super Mario Odyssey is pure delight. And if you've never played Super Mario Odyssey, I highly recommend it. It's just it's just a, a unique, very pure gaming experience. Hey Kyle, your live streams require true devotion to get through the longest intro on YouTube, says Beard PL. Well, Dr. Disrespect's intro is actually longer than mine, but I appreciate it. Dark Jester with the five. Ooh. Uh, the new bot is sentient decided that it needed to assert its dominance. Says Dark Jester. Well, good thing that they can't correct your your use of grammar, Dark. Um, we have Liz Calvert with the 20 in chat. Hey, Cy Kyle, or Cy Browse, whichever one you want. No tiny question, no no tiny human question this week. Instead, would you please do a birthday shout out? Tiny human is nine today, and I am old now. Alex, happy birthday from me, Kyle Mann, and all of us here at the facility. I hope you have a wonderful birthday, tiny human. Your hair is getting long. It looks glorious. I hope school is going well. Hope you have a great day. Hope you get everything that you wish for. Uh, Dead Card with the five says no comment. What? 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 A mad... Rex Wrath, welcome. Rex says, hey Kyle, I take it you're not maidenless. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Chat. We make our way to the gaming command center here at the facility. 275 inch monitors to see what you are saying and what we are playing. What are we playing today? The Elden, the Eldenist of Ring. We're going to be playing on my two 27 inch monitors in front of me. Curved. No. They're not small. I'm just huge. Ugh. That was a good eight ounces of coffee. 
PS6 controller. We've been playing on a PS5 controller. That's being a little uh, PS4 controller. It's being a little wonky. Every time I move it, it's disconnected. But you can see. Uh, oh, I was even wrong. So wait, when we uh, jumped in last time to Elden Ring, we were at seven out six hours because I had played it for like two hours at a time and uh, uninstalled it three times. So now we are at 31 hours, which, chat, you can do the math. I have played 25 hours of this game off stream. You got me, okay? What did we do? We, uh, we've defeated, off stream, we defeated Magma Worm, Renala, Dragon Skin Soldier, Royal Knight, Loretta, Red Wolf. Yeah, we did a lot off stream. But well, that's fine. Shut up and take my money. Thank you, TJ, with the four ninety nine. Kyle, do you prefer Xbox, PC, or PS five? I assume you mean. I I have a PC. I have PCs and a PS five. Um, for a big game, well, for a game I'm really excited about, I prefer to play it on the PS five. Um, because that's what my giant television is connected to. But, you know, I'm, I'm only playing Elden Ring on PC right now. You know what I mean? Thank you for sharing so much passion and joy about science, says Geo Emperor. You are all beautiful nerds and you make this community brighter every day. Geo, thank you. We're hopping right in. Now, I turned on online mode, chat. So that if there's any funny messages or deaths, you'll be able to see them. I don't like to play online, because most messages are pretty dumb. Could you swing a sword with a sword? Could you swing a sword with enough force to cause a gust of wind, like the Stormblade weapon skill, says William Martin. Um, I guess we'll have to get to Snakey Snake Boy to really answer that. But right off the top of the dome? No. Welcome to a scientist place, Elden Ring. Okay, chat. So I made some improvements since last time we played. Um, obviously, I got the I got the uh, Bloodhound Blade, like you all told me to. I leveled it up. It's on level four right now. I am level 60, 68. Um, you can see, uh, I've been buffing my vigor, endurance, strength, dexterity, not even touching intelligence or faith because I have a lot of those and none of the other. Uh, it took me forever to get my PS5. Is it safe to assume that it was hard for you as well? Says Dark Jester. No, I got my PS5 real quick. I got my PS5 when it was a bundle with Miles Morales. So I got it like two years ago. Something like that. Love that the death counter is carrying over from the last session. Thank you for reminding me. So, we're at 19, and almost, I'd say, 99% of those are your fault. You told me to attack the Gaul way too quick, and so I died too many times. So, we'll be continuing on from there. Um, so, you can see my stats. Level 68, almost nice. Pumping up the vigor and the dexterity so I can swing this bad boy, which I've been two-handing. Um, I need better armor. I haven't found better armor than this beginning surcoat. That's just how it is. Oh, also, now so that you can see just how close we are to dying. Dan, welcome back. Nice to see you again, buddy. Um, now, I, so you can see how close I am to dying at any one moment. I moved your chat window to the right so you can see what I'm doing with my life points bloodhound fanger as they call it easy mode says me poindexter hey I didn't know that that's just what chat told me to do I can't even put any ashes of war on it so we also did a like I said we'll be getting any science time in there that we can find but right now I'm in Kalid apparently and um, you all voted to go do some splorin So, 
<laughs> Remember how before, on the last stream, we basically only had like this much of the map uncovered, right? So I've done a little bit more since then. Just a little bit. Where do we go exploring? Corpse Stench Shack. Hey, this, this smells like crap. I think the, um... So, you know, I know... Oh, I want to go get this map. That's what I wanted to do. So let's do that. I'm going to do that real quick. I don't know what's the best way to get there. I guess we'll find out. Volcano. Northwest. We want exploring and science time out of anything worth sciencing. Well, that's what you're going to get, baby. All right. All right, this swamp sucks. Now, how... Okay, that's definitely not how I get up there. Hey. Volcano Manor in the northwest is ideal right now. Unless you want to continue exploring Caleb. Northwest, huh? Like, uh... Up, up yonder? Up here? By the, by the shack? By the stent shack? Filled with putrescine? Why your turd so big? Now, we said last time, chat, that uh, dung beetles navigate by the light... By the light of the Milky Way, in the absence of any light pollution. But they actually do roll up dung. They uh, they put a little larval larva in there, and then the larva eats all the sweet, sweet dung. Oops. Okay, so you all want to explode. Huh? The heck is this thing? Okay. Good job. Okay, can't get up that way. Hey, are you just gonna, like, spew, or...? Okay, cool. This area is really cool. This is two and four. Volcano Ac Manor gives you access to some of the best armor in the game. Oh, yeah, uh... Yeah. I want the... I want the armor with the guy with two... The, the, uh, Siamese twin guy. That armor is sick. What's up, Alex? Welcome. Okay. You guys convinced me. I could do the Volcano Manor skip as well, right? What am I, a speedrunner? Could, he, could, he, could a large bug even roll that much poo? Bugs don't get that large, Chet. We've talked about this before. Um, bugs breathe through holes in their body. They don't... Well, <laughs> everything breathes through a hole in its body. But, um... So, when you breathe, you are breathing in air through your mouth body. Oh, I hate those things. And, uh... It goes into your lungs, into your bronchial tubes, and it is... Gas transfer is made... Ah! Ah! Gas transfer is made possible. Alex Schumer, welcome. Um, I'm trying to let this thing go by so I can get up that ladder. Gas transfer is made possible by just the crazy amount of surface area inside of your lungs. Go, 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 go. So, uh, ins... Ah! No! Inside your lungs, your bronchial tubes are kind of like expand fractally. There's like one tube, and then there's more tubes that look like that tube, and then more tubes that look like those tubes, and it just rap it, it rapidly, rapidly increases the surface area. Surface area size of the tennis court? Yeah, I mean, it's huge, comparatively. But what a bug does is breathe through holes directly on its body. And so those holes depend on the surface area of the body. Now, 
the surface area of a... It's hard to focus and be scared at the same time. Now, the surface area of a body is de dependent directly on... Uh... Okay, okay, thank you. Um, the square of the body's proportions, right? So if, if your height is dependent on... Pick it up, pick it up. Length, the unit is length. Then your surface area is length times length. Pick it up! Um, and your volume is length times length times length. Length, length cubed. Pick it up! Oh my god. Oh my god. Get off your horse. 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 Anytime now. Go ahead and get off of it. Get up. Get all. Go ahead and jump. Go ahead and jump. Go ahead and jump. Go ahead and do the jump. Go ahead and do do the jump, and go ahead and go ahead. And go ahead and jump, and go ahead and jump, and go ahead and get off your horse, and go ahead and get off your horse, and awesome. <laughs> Chat, I can't even pause the game right now. Dave Breen with the 10. Just quick restart. Quick little restart. Uh, can you say hi to my kids? Sophia and Jack love the show. Dave? Absolutely. Sophia, Jack, hello from one of your favorite science people. Hopefully. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Your dad, Dave, is a pretty cool guy. And now you can't refute that because I said it. Um. Okay, so my... My buttons no longer work on my controller. So we're going to go ahead and quit the game. <laughs> let's let's just let's do it. Let's, let's let's just stop the game real quick. Let's let's see what's going on here. <laughs> okay. All right. What I was trying to say chat before I was so rudely interrupted is that uh, because bugs th breathe through the sides of their body, and that's dependent on surface area, surface area doesn't scale as quickly as volume does. So it's a cubed relationship for volume versus a squared relationship for surface area. And so as something gets bigger, it gets much, much bigger in volume than it does in its surface area. And at some point, there's too much volume to provide oxygen to given the holes in the body for bugs. So bugs can't get as big. Hopefully this works. Hi, good video. Greetings from Peru. It says, Sir Bigotes. Who needs buttons? Just get good. All right, it's cool. Yeah, I was, I was just saying how my uh, controller was being a little wonky-tonk, huh? Okay, looks like it's working now. And now, welcome to a science display as Elvin. That doesn't count as a death chat. Okay. Get off your horse. There we go. If it does it again, I'm going to turn offline off. Just to... Just to be there. Fact about bugs is Matthew. Bugs are icky. Not true. Most bugs are pretty awesome. Yinser says, hey... Oh. I already did the science. Just want to say I'm a big fan of your work. Love the videos, how you incorporate gaming and sci-fi into your ideas. Always managing to keep them interesting and entertaining. Very kind of you to say. Thank you. We'll be having um, some more pop culture videos very soon. Uh, namely, I think we're working with Dead Space to do a video on the channel. And we are also... Where's Volcano Manor? None of this looks, uh, volcanic to me. Am I going the right direction, chat? Just follow along. You'll get there. Thanks. Uh-oh. 
Hey guys. There's something in the air following me. Or not. Hey. Come on. Oh, it was just that low <laughs> a low resolution bird. Got it. Alright. You wanna do that? Ooh, nice move. You tricked me. He tricked me. And not, not two times, though. Not two times. Not two times. <laughs> As Liz says, don't forget to like and subscribe. And um, if you are a werewolf like me, you can like and subscribe. <laughs> hey. Are you were you eating that guy? <laughs> hey, are you are you guys eating those those guys? Don't do that. Oh, okay, sure. The uh the heavy attack on your horse is so slow. Oops. Come on, come on. Just clearing them out. Just clearing them out real quick. Just get a little bit of runes. Just a little bit of runes. Not even worried about it. Oh, okay, I'm worried about it. Chat, I wasn't paying attention. I, I, I wasn't paying attention and I blame that on you again if you because of this joke from Aiden if you're a compound organism of cy cyanobacteria you can like and subscribe boo biggest bird to ever live says dark jester with the five biggest cephalopod uh the biggest cephalopod is a colossal squid in terms of weight biggest bird to ever ever live depends on what you mean by bird um if you mean like a non-avian dinosaur well if you allow me a non-avian dinosaur then you have something like quetzalcoatlus who towered above other birds i don't need these runes i want to get to volcano manor like you said i don't i don't care about these cannibals i don't care about Ooh, I kind of, I kind of care about this guy. Though. Whoa! What? Since when you get lighting? Since when you get fire? <laughs> Blood loss is the strongest mechanic. Chocobos? No. All right, get out of my face. Am I going towards? Alexis, that means a lot to me. Thank you. If I can help in any way, it's my honor. That's perfume, actually, not fire. Uh... No, it looked like something that, when aerosolized, catches fire. Um, that can be super dangerous. Um, when certain materials, like dust or, or certain uh, metal shavings... Oh, God. I hate that thing get aerosolized and atomized. They're basically just tiny dust particles in the air. They can catch fire rapidly and sometimes even spontaneously if they're pyrophoric. And that's scary. That's why there's a lot... Ah! There's a... Ah! I hate this thing. There's... That's why there's a lot of dust control in places like sawmills, etc., etc. <laughs> Nothing looks very, very volcanic. I don't see any sulfur. Maybe this yellow stuff is sulfur. Don't see any sulfur. Don't see any ash. Oh, maybe that's... Yeah, maybe that is a sulfur. And the heat? Okay. Okay, game. All right. If that's heat coming out from geothermal vents or uh, from uh, magma t tubes and that's yellowish sulfur, then yeah, that's a good design. Good job. You're at the foothills of the volcano. Yeah, I don't want to fight this guy. I hate this guy. So I'm going to see if I can... Outspeed him! Go, 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 Sugar mill explosion. Exactly. Yeah, sugar mill, uh, sawmill, um, metalworking things. 
Uh, don't know, Kyle, but if you press heavy attack right after using your weapon special skill, you do like a teleport attack. Super cool and big range. I did not know that. Let me see. What? Ah, oh, he came back up! How did he come up? You you have too many legs to be here. Get out of my face. I did not- oh, that was sick! I did not- I did not know that. I hate those things. Those grafted guys. Just makes me think of the magic card grafted exoskeleton. Um, Liz, I like hairy crabs. The little hairy crabs that live at geothermal vents. What's amazing about this game is basically anywhere that you can see, you can actually go. Careful, it uses up FP. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Hey, let's try it out on this fool. <laughs> That's sick! I've used this weapon for like 20 hours, and that's the first time I knew about that. He made it to the volcano? I'm so proud. Oh, I've done me I've I've beaten Renala, everything in Rhea Lucaria. Uh I'm I'm decently into the game at this point. The way that all things are reverting back to crab, how long do you think until we get crab mechs? Go check out the Hacksmith's latest video for a spider slash crab like mech. Um, but what you're referring to is carcinization. The tendency for things to evolve towards crap. Now, I put an entire video out on this on the main channel, which you can go watch. So I won't explain it fully. What I will say is... Come here, you dummy. What's up there? You gonna shoot me from up there? What I will say is that it's a bit of a misunderstanding that the that pop culture took. Uh-oh, they got bombs that pop culture took from the phenomenon, it's not... Uh-oh. 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 Whirling dervishes. It's not that everything is tending towards crab. It's that already crab-like animals tend towards... Ha uh, uh, a number of them have tended towards more crab-like traits. Um, tail, no tail, or tail tucked underneath. Um, flattened carapace, more symmetrical. Um... But what isn't mentioned in a lot of these pop culture representations of carcinization is that um, decarcinization also happens. So it's already crab-like things tending towards crab, so not humans or birds or anything else. And there's also decarcinization. You can point to examples of crabs becoming more crabby, but also some crabs becoming less crabby. And I'm not just talking about their attitude. Chat, like the video. Like, like I'm giving you more educational density than you get in school. Hey, are you alive? Cool. Can't tell because you all have your mouth open like dummies. Uh oh. Hey. Uh oh Did you just summon everybody? How much? Eh. You're not worth my time, mate. Volcano Manor! Cool. So you're liking Elden Ring after all, says the fox. I was wrong. I told you. I told you I was wrong. I've played this game for 25 hours. <laughs> that guy fell off the bridge. Thank you, Stream Elements. Um... I played this game for 25 hours off stream. Oliver with the 20, hey Kyle, longtime fan, just want to say that I love your videos. You're one of the reasons I went into a career in science. Consider an degree in either physics or chemistry. Thanks for inspiring me. Oliver, I have said many times that no matter what we make, no matter what my legacy is, the only thing, my guiding light, is that I want people. 10 years from now, or whatever, however old you are, 
to come up to me and say, you helped me get an interest in science or you, you inspired me to do X, Y, Z because of that thing you did. And so, Oliver, you are um, validating and humbling and honoring me. Whatever you choose, I'm sure you will be absolutely dope at it. Now, why would I climb up that if I could just yump it? Verns, I've played most of the other FromSoft games, and I don't think it's... It's definitely... It's not outclassed. I mean, in terms of world design and world design and art direction, it's definitely near the top. Just in, in scope and scale. Oh, no! No, no, I hate this thing! No, I've seen people fight this thing, and I don't want to... Ah. To me, my puppies! <laughs> damn it! <laughs> oh, damn it! No! Uh, uh, bye-bye. Okay, you, yeah, you stay there. Don't do anything. Oh, whoop. Wait. Okay, yeah, don't, yeah, don't, yeah, just slowly walk at me. I hate this thing. Alright, let's rumble. After I use this. <laughs> Damn it! not going well. I haven't had a single hit on him yet. Oh! I saw it coming, too. Come on. Come on. Hit! Jump! Oh, this is not going well. No, this is, this is like, uh, this is basically an antlion scorpion bull, right? Yeah, stay there. Do you have a weak point? Damn it! Uh oh. Oh, come on. Uh oh! Uh -oh. I'm not doing any damage to him, chat. Is there a... I need to... I need him to go down. Or get some blood loss or something. Hit! Come on. Alright, now I'm gonna get wrecked. Cool. Cool. I need the horse. Damn! <laughs> you suck, dude! dodged. I'm dead. Twenty-one. Man, that thing sucks. TK Rubin, that's very kind of you to say. Appreciate it. It's actually, um... Try killing the boss until it's dead. Got it. Thank you. Um, it was actually something that Bill Nye said to me that inspired me to have kind of that that outlook. About legacy, you know. I have watched you since Because Science. I love you and your content. If you know any Swedish, I'd love to hear it. Says Dr. Sedwall. I do not know any Swedish. And I'm pretty sure it would be comical if I tried. Do I even actually need to fight this thing? Can I just go to the manor? Because I feel like this is going to take me a long, long time. Oh, God. Can I just go to it? Hey. Hey, give me that. <laughs> is there a way to... Do I have to fight this thing? You can skip him. Head to the right and jump from the route rock outcrop. 
Oh, there? Oh, like, like, like that? For the stupid guy's messages? Oh, I see, oh, I see, I messed up. No, don't skip him! No, no, don't skip him! What are you talking about? Oh, I can just go that way. Wait, I can just go that way. Oh, oh, chat. Alright, do you want me to fight this thing or not? Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> chat! Chat! That one's on you. That one's on you. Because <laughs> my, uh, my, uh, build is all around bleed and, and physical damage. I have no magic to attack this guy. Alright, fine. I'm skipping. I'll come back. Pick up zero runes. Why even... Ask me if I want to pick those up if there's nothing there. Yeet. There we go. Easy. Why am I... I don't need to kill this guy. Why am I doing that? Because I lust for death. Looks like there's a golden seed over here. Gimme, gimme. Excuse me. You can enchant your weapon with magic buffs, no? Oh, you're right, I could. I do have a bunch of greets. Hmm. A lot of people said skip it, so we'll, we'll skip it for now. Okay, so I want to intercept this thing. Hit. Damn it. Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, so you're going to come back right here. Oh. Hit. Hit. Trying to intercept an invisible creature. Okay, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Is it random how you move? We'll see. Well, maybe focus on the stuff you can do. Good luck, this one is frustrating. Does it take a random path each time, or can I just... It's a set path. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we will outsmart it. I don't even know what it is. Grease very good on the sword. Chat, let's get to um, a waypoint, and then maybe we see how, how the grease hits the insect boy. Stay on its path and whack it when it gets close. What does it look like I'm doing? Damn it! <laughs> okay, I'm not going to wait three minutes to do that every time. Yes, we skip everything. What the heck is that guy? Isn't that the, uh, the beast? The beastman? Isn't that the beast guy? Beast priest? <laughs> Blood grease. Madness giant. Got it. Let's see what I got here. I have fire grease, magic grease, lightning grease, rot grease, blood grease. Yeah. Fire grease. Dragon wound grease. Volcano minor pet. Quest time. Got it. This guy looks kind of mean, huh? Let's see. I Before I get annihilated, let's see if we can get a waypoint. This looks just like the entrance to the fire temple. Nick, welcome. Good to see you again. How you feeling? Jesus. Calm down, bro. Longstar beasts are weak to magic, fire, lightning, and holy. Well, I have all of that. Yes. I'm gonna put this away out of reverence. This is Kyle's first playthrough for the game. Yes. I've uninstalled this game three times. But as I said in the intro, ooh, look at this place. In the interim, I have fallen in love with it. It is very good. I was wrong. You are wrong. 
And this, but this is my first full playthrough. I haven't made it through like the first two hours before, and now I am. Uh. Hey, big boy. Aren't you precocious? We rarely receive visitors to the volcano manor without invitation. Yeah, maybe it's the big madness giant out there. And not unlike another guest we had long ago. So tarnished. Have you ever harbored doubts? Never, not once in my life. And the dogmatic ramblings of the fingers. If you Why have, do you switch to streaming on YouTube instead of on Twitch? I wanted everything in one place. Fight with us. Easy, easy to cross pollinate. Against the Erd tree. Okay. Your decision is most welcome. Now you belong to the Volcano Manor family. I know I. The I, drawing room lies down the hall. You can just go into anyone's surface. Because Doesn't really matter, right? I am Tanith, the proprietress of this house. An honor to have you. I like your voice. It's pretty. The drawing room is. Use the key I hand. Nice place you got here. Amazing weapon up here. What is your best Dark Soul? It says, Senor Piotis. I don't know what that means. Thank you, Ghost, for showing me the way. I know there's also a secret path behind where she's sitting somewhere. But we'll get there when we can. Go upstairs, Kyle. Everybody, calm down! Finish all the quests first before killing the big snakes, is Leo Orstein. Yeah, that's at the bottom of Volcano Manor, right? The big guy. We will be together forever, that guy. A pleasure to meet you, Brave Tarnished. I have... I am Raya, the scout. Very pleased I have to Lower Lumbar to Lordosis. Manor, under Lady Tanith's guidance. May you tread the path of valor. Okay. Dude, you look pretty sick. I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what is on your head. What is that? Who are you? Who are you? What buddy? in heaven's name are you doing here? I'll tell you there. The volcano manor is a pit of recusants who spit at grace and hunt our own kind. I don't know. Sounds pretty I hope sick. you understand the weight of my words. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's a metaphor. Got it. Well, as long as you understand what you're saying. But know that the path you walk is blasphemy and leads only to a miserable death. Before you can I don't know, I'm a millennial, it sounds not so bad. Think on that. Okay. This blasphemous path before you can see so now I can fight other people. Right. You can get real good armor from the letter on the table. I show someone the letter. Is that it? Okay, I made myself at home. Time to go upstairs. Read the letter. Got it. Chat, you're so smart. What is this? Eh. Of a tarnish to be hunted. Ah. So you want me to start hunting my... Oh, this is like an assassin's house. Got it. Shout out to the stream mods and everyone else with the facility, says DK Rubin. Thanks, DK. What should I say? Donkey Kong Rubin. Just wondering how fast I could do that. I was, uh... Leveling up my endurance so I can become a nice chonky boy. A lot of people died in here, huh? Wonder why that is. Wrong button. But I'll take it. That's why. Oh, they. Trade. Ah! That's a lot of blood. And. Dutch. Do what you taught me. 
Uh, I was trying to do the invisible attack. Uh, bye bye, dumb guy. Smithing stone six. I think I need a somber smithing stone four. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> this is what just went through my head. Excuse me, lords and ladies. Please sit down. I have an urgent message from the battlefront. They told me to do this. <laughs> Enjoy your floor food, losers. <laughs> Sprint. Who the hell was it? Was he wearing a wolf mask? Who the? F who was that guy? <laughs> See ya! Go check the weapon you got, Kyle. The physical special attack on it's awesome. Yeah, it's probably not better than the weapon I'm holding, right? Press the heavy attack for the invisible part. Yeah, no, I did! I tried! I pressed the wrong button, alright? Calm down. If I kill the guy that will give me the good armor, as you are saying... Yeah, I can use it, but I'd have to upgrade it. Because I have enough strength. Because I'm a freaking strong as frick. Ooh, but it also causes blood loss buildup. But it'll be really slow. Hmm. I love that weapon. What headphones are you using, Kyle? Says Alistair. I am using the Dr. Disrespect Custom Turtle Beach Bluetooth headphones. Which new characters do you recommend? I've never played Elden Ring. It says, Sir Bigotes. Dice Sir Bigotes. Uh, you no sé. Bigotes. Um, I've only played this... I've never played this game all the way through before. So... Your guess is as good as mine. I need that mappy. Right there. Where's my other waypoint? No, is that a map too? Yeah, I'll keep that. Is this game better on console or PC? Don't know. Only played it on PC. I've seen you in Doc's chat. It says RM Link. Yeah, I um, I like to have streamers on while I play. Science time incoming. Sooner, eventually. Um, how many uh, runes do I have? Yeah. We'll get the map. We'll come back. We'll slice this guy's butt up. Uh, we'll see if we can upgrade the pizza cutter. We got a lot of things to do, chat. Donde esta la... I don't know how to say map. I'm not looking. Yeah, come right to me. Come right to... Come right to me. There you go. Oh, come on! That was it! Oh, or I can go fight the uh, giant spirit in Necron. My parents got Tiny Human a guitar. Hell yeah. Ah, fingers! I hate these guys. <laughs> One shot. One shot. Kyle, also doing, after doing two assassination missions for the manor, they'll give you their own assassination quest, which gives you even better armor, says Leo. Leo, I have a question. Hey man, need a hand? <laughs> um, Leo, I have a question. If I... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's have more of them. Yeah, yeah. Let's get all of them. If I start doing assassination quests, will it make me a bad guy? You know what I mean? Like, will it make me, like... How will it change my quest lines? Does it make me a bad dude? Like, something that Lady Ron Ronnie wouldn't like. Come on. Come on. God, they move so gross. And that's why it's good. Because they just, from the way they move, you're like, ugh. Actually looks like the alien, uh, the face hugger, huh? Uh, uh, no, no, there are no repercussions. What is, uh, Ronnie doesn't care, won't change your quest lines. It's actually part of the quest line for the manor. Not at all, not really. Everyone has a, cr a crush on Ronnie. Yeah, have you seen her? She's hot. And she has two faces and a bunch of hands. You know what that means. Loves for days. Ooh. 
Chat, will you calm down? I'm gonna put you in horny jail. Yep. See, usually what I like to do in this game, what I've noticed my gameplay loop is that if I have about half, if I'm like at 50% of a level's runes, I will, before going anywhere else, just so I don't lose, you know, like 50%, I will go grind somewhere, get the level up, go down to like zero runes, and then do the hard thing. Lots of hands, you say, says Nick. Yeah, Nick, look at, look up a picture of Lady Ronnie and you'll... Then, you, then DM me on Instagram. You'll know what I'm talking about. Um, what was I doing? All right, you said it doesn't affect me to go and... There we go. To go and do that quest line. So let's go kill this guy. I feel like this is going to alter my gameplay. I feel like you're lying to me, chat. I don't like being lied to. But here we are. It's a great start, Kyle. I do the same, says TJ York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, good strategy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, chat. Despite what the previous stream made it look like, I'm not bad at the game. You just made me fight something too hard. And what I needed to do was level up, get a better weapon, etc., 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 etc. Hey. Hey. Ow. Hey, hey, it's okay. <laughs> he was reading Reddit threads. That's how it felt. Wait, have you died 22 times today, says Chompy? No. Only died three times today. Or, er, yeah. I'm... We will keep a, a total tally for the playthrough. Now, am I going the wrong direction? Maybe. <laughs> Um, will I play the whole game on stream? I don't know. That depends. Apparently pumpkin heads have bees in their helmet? Oh, shit. Really? I found Sekiro to be harder in this game. Sekiro's hard, man. I couldn't beat, um, the second owl fight in Sekiro at the end. Shit was hard, man. I can't, I tried, I tried to focus, I really, I... Tr you're going backwards. <laughs> Tried hard. Couldn't beat him. My final death count was like 700 or something. Okay. So, so Rex, I will endeavor to embarrass you. Wow. He had so many fewer deaths than 700. Yeah, Chad, that's how you play a game smartly, I think. Like this. Grind when you need to, level up when you need to. Kyle, I'd love to show you all the hidden quests. They have amazing feel and let you immerse better in the world. Says Idrix. Let's, um, let's get through the stuff I've never seen or done before, before we do all the hidden stuff. Unless it has kick-ass gear. I also did all the bosses and such. <laughs> Sekiro is great. I love, um, ooh, to fight you in a frickin' coliseum? Oh, no, right here. Hey. Can I ride my horse while I fight you? Oh, uh, but I have, a, I have a bunch of rune... Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. There's nothing around here, so... It'll be easy to get back. It'll be easy to get back! Necron has a really cool spirit ash. Oh, you mean the mimic tier? They nerfed that. But don't I get it from the blood boy? Oh, I'm invading. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, that's where the Coliseum is for the DLC. Got it. What's up, big boy? Okay, can't do that. Oop, I don't have all my healing items. Okay. <laughs> I didn't do the... Why am I doing the invisible attack? Oh, that's why. Do it! Do the attack! Oh, yeah. This guy's freaking toast. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! 
Oh, are you out? <laughs> nice dodge. Nice dodge. I'll give it to you. Oh, hello. Oh, wrong button. Ugh. Wrong button. Bye bye. Whoa. Uh -oh. One more hit. Oh, this is even a different world, so it doesn't, like, who cares if I kill a guy in a different universe? The guy is more poison than you. Don't worry about it. See, the the issue was is that I kept pressing the special attack and not pressing the, whatever, doesn't matter. No Ordinary Rio. Welcome. Facility Gamer. Do I have the strength, the uh, endurance to wear all this? I got some other cool shit, but it's not... Like, I want to be a skeleton bone boy. But... Oh, yeah. That's way better. Way better. Way better. I'm still at medium load. That's critical. Way better. <laughs> yes! I am Kyle Man. Slayer of... Men, I suppose. Now grab the arena. I don't want to do the arena right now. Um, what do you mean grab it? Just open it so I have it? Um, Buster. Oh, man. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Framey gamey. Um, what did I say I was going to do next? What are we going to do next, chat? Should I go back? Do I continue on the, uh... Do I go back and tell them that I murdered that man? Fashion is better than stats. I agree. I want. I wish you could transmorg in this so I could pick any armor that I have. Kyle, there's more than one assassination. Is this high? Uh, is this armor high poise? Is that what you're talking about? Look how high my gosh dang poise is right now. Oh yeah, way higher. Let me see. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, psh. gonna interrupt my attack? Don't think so. Did you harvest enough iron from blood of your enemies to make a sword, says Alex Schumer. Yes. Um, so you'll see that meme in a lot of places, or like, I got the, the iron for this sword for a uh, person's blood. Now, the amount of iron in in a person's blood... Someone please kill him. That horrendous serpent. Traitor Reichard. Okay, I will, eventually. Um... There's about enough iron in the average amount of human blood in a body. <laughs> Go Sir Kyalot, says Dave Breen with the two. Yes. There's about enough iron in the human body's blood to make about a nail. A good size nail. A good size iron nail. So I've actually done the math, math on this before. Of course you have. That it would take between like 300 and 400 people to get enough iron out of all their blood to make a sword. Hey, buddy, you good? You good, bro? You're tarnished. We get it. You have a cool voice. The demigods to the sword. Then please. Big Saint, welcome. Kill the great serpent. The one that. Elden Ring players said their weapon glowing. How do you do it? Oh, well, you you and just enchant it with something, yeah? I left the serpent slaying spear in the Lord's chamber. Worthy tarnished, the great serpent. Okay. What's creepy is that when you kill him and then his, like, the lady that worships him, like, starts eating him, like, oh, I got it. I, I have to. Do I get a new. Where do I get a new. Thing, Majig? Assassin letter. From the lady? From the lady of the manor? I'm looking at chat, sorry. 
Did you read the letter left for you? That oh, is yes. The task. The mob, you will be compensated if you are loath to hunt your own. But you must leave this house. This is a war against the Erd Tree. Why? What did the we tree do to you? place for the meek, nor the luxury of keeping clean hands. You've completed. I am pleased. Now, this is your. Meek. <laughs> uh, sorry, I got excited. Never forget that the recusant fights to tread the path of the champ. The way is tainted. It is the true path. Okay, so. Now you are a recusant. Okay. I am pleased oh. to have you. Stop talking to my samurai now ghost. You are I am pleased. Don't talk to my samurai ghost, please. The Erdtree sucks the life out of the lands between, that's what. Oh. Doesn't, um... Doesn't Millennia want you to kill, uh, burn the Erdtree as well for that? Is that why? Oh, there you go. Yeah. Let's read. Let's see who else we have to murder, chat. Who, who's who gotta go? Did that. Who's gotta go? All right, I get so excited to knock uh, tables over and jumping for joy all the time. You want to know a secret chat that I literally can't tell you? Um, can I upgrade my weapon? I don't know if I if I finally got the the somber smithing stone. Well, let's see if we can upgrade the. Uh, oh yeah, the pizza cutter. The person who did all the world build the the person who did all the world building on this game is uncredited. And I cannot tell you who it is. Ooh, mysterious. No, Millennia, she wants you to die. You're thinking of Ronnie, and yes, the same reason. Isn't Millennia like your friend? Talk to Patches and Bernal after this assassination. Is he the big... Is he the... Is he, Who's he? No, it's not George R. Martin. Or it could be lying. Who knows? Not Malent... Not... You know who I'm... Well, you know who I mean. Where have you been hiding? No, not the super hard... I took you for that matter. Not the super hard... Uh, well... The lady at the beginning. Hell yeah, I got it. Bam. This thing is a beast right now. If I should upgrade, I also got Moonveil chat. What should I be upgrading? What should I be upgrading? Should I be upgrading on the side? So I think I have a couple of good things. Uh, serpent, Curve Sword, Magworm Sword, Moonveil, Pizza Cutter, Raptor Talons. What should I be leveling up? Melina, not Melania. Sorry. You jumped off the balcony by the round table yet? No. Don't people invade you if you do that? Honestly, whatever looks the coolest. Bloodhound. Well, I just did that. What do you want to level up, Kai? This thing's probably really slow, huh? Alright. Since nobody can be... decisive... Uh... Should we keep assassinating people, chat, or should we do something else? I want, like, sweet... I want sweet loot. <laughs> How good is my eyesight? Oh, Atlas Plains, which is... here? Bam. You're a dead man. You just don't know it yet. Was it one or two? Gosh darn it, it was one. Got it. Right down there. Right down there. How do I get down there? 
Can I drop? Yeah, probably. Why not make YouTube live polls? Says Vanaheim Stories. Uh, yeah, I could. Approach from the south. Eh, everyone knows everything about this game, huh? Ooh, and there's a mine over there, too. Oh, yeah, I don't have very much uh, intelligence. What? I don't have... <laughs> I, I don't have very much intelligence, ironically enough, so... Um, yeah, Moonvale wouldn't be as good. Have the YouTube policy changes affect your vids any, Kyle? Um, no. I mean, I don't... Oh, I'm gonna get hit with, uh... Firebomb in a second? Um, I don't, I don't swear in any video on the facility. So, no. On the main channel. I have had some shorts on this channel demonetized. Um, because of, like, gory content or, or something. Um... But no. Uh, and those are like two, and the channel's brand new, so who cares? Um, but nothing on the main channel, no. Hey, if Edrix, if you have a thousand hours, you say go fang, I'll go fang, buddy. How the heck do I get down there? Wait, did I go the wrong way again? Sure did, baby. It's number one. Ha <laughs> ha. Chat, why didn't you tell me? It's a great looking game. This is on, um... This is on medium. I play on maximum. When I'm not streaming. And it still looks great. Uh, chat! We've been live for almost an hour and a half. What I want you to do is if you haven't liked the video yet, please like the video now. Please... Please, please like the video now. Um... In a couple minutes, we'll take a short break so we can all stretch and um, excrete various waste products from our bodies. Um, and then we'll be back with more Science and Elden Ring. What, we didn't uninstall? Says Orion. No, quite the opposite, Orion. You were right. I was wrong. This game's actually pretty, pretty great. And now we're deep into it. I surprised everyone by showing that I put in 25 hours over the weekend... And now, it's time to game like gamers. Are you much for SPS? SP Ed blah. Yeah. I like FPS games. I don't... I'm not much of a competitive... Actually, I don't really play any competitive shooter. So, I do like FPSs. Like, my favorite recently uh, has got to be, like, uh, Doom Eternal. Just fantastic. Um, that's probably the most recent... FPS. Right? I think so. What was it that finally got you to enjoy the game? You know what it was? After I got uh, frustrated by chat telling me to fight this bloodhound guy at a low level, uh, I went and went on the main quest path and I didn't go into any like weird cave or anything. And once I uh, got up enough levels to start actually killing the bosses and going through areas. Everything started to make a lot more sense. I'm a single player guy. I don't really like multiplayer. Just because I get really stressed out by it. Maybe I'll look at chat and you at the same time. Or look at this. Look at my peripheral vision. It's incredible. Do you know who's confusingly good at FPS games? Uh, Posty. Post Malone is very good at Apex Legends. 
Like he plays with pros sometimes. Like he plays with like Timmy and Asu. He's really good. Which is, you don't expect it, but. Wait. God bless America! Chat, why aren't you. Why aren't you directing me properly? <laughs> I play Apex here and there. Yeah, Apex is a great game. You don't like multiplayer? Time to invade? No, I will I will turn off. I'll I turned it on for you guys, so you guys could see uh, all the messages and bloodstains and stuff. But if you invade me, I'll just turn it off. <laughs> Not interested. Let's annihilate this guy, huh? Chat, how do I get the cool uh, gold and silver uh, Siamese twin guy's armor? Oh my gosh, he's big. Oh no, he's big. Whoa, hello. <laughs> that attack is so dope. Blood loss. I think I might be too high level for this part of the quest line. Yes. Yes. You fool. Your blood has been spilled. Oh. They, uh, they reduce your number of potions when you're in a different world? Huh. Why do they do that? Siamese twin armor you get from running the guy's quest line until he sends you deep underground. What guys? Oh, the that guy. I've been playing Mass Effect 3 right now, says Tactical Bucket. I it's it's such a depressing game. It's really good. It's really good. It's just very depressing. When I go back and play, I just play two. I see you performed another task for us. Here is your unit. Okay, now you said for me to talk about, uh, talk to someone else, huh? Whew. See that, chat? Now, We're not just gaming. We're not just sciencing. You, you gotta keep... Of the true ruler of this manor, you gotta keep your, your vessel Lord intact. You know? The Erd Tree blessed the tarnished with grace, but it was all too meager in the face of the enormity of their You like my, my new Prip Cat tattoo, chat? To scavenge, squabbling for crumbs, like the shard bearers Vying for I'm a power cool guy in the now. wake of the shattering, our lord, indignant, has refused to scurry about, fighting over what miserly scraps they allow us. If the only okay. are willing to raise the battle, we at the Volcano Manor, under Lord Rikard, have. If you follow this hero, the lord's visits with us. It cannot come. If you follow, the it cannot come. How cool is that serpent bone sword? Good time to talk to Bernal and Patches. Is that Bernal? Wait, I know that. Wait. If you follow no. this heroic path, I know he's the guy you fight or can fight. I remember who Pat. Where's Patches? Where the hell's Patches? Patches of Hulan. Bernal is the guy in the room. Oh. Okay. Give me more assassination targets. So. You blooded your sword in the hunt. What is on your face? Then I shall introduce myself once more. Banal. A recusant just like you. Recusants have particular battle arts styled to our methods of slaughter. What is that? Why not add some to your repertoire? You must kill her. You don't have to, I think. You can leave her eating... Lord Rikard. You've come to understand to take power and the recusant to raise the flag of revolt against this sanctified pillaging. We recusants must become the most wretched of predators. Nice big ass sword you got there, science boy. This is Galaxy Warrior. <laughs> I know, right? This thing would probably be way too heavy. Is this Patches? <laughs> Have you any strange sounds here at the manor? Are you sure it's not just Something your scoliosis? Oh, fuck. It just isn't. Yeah, there's a big snake underground. Who sits around where? Where? 
Just get all the Ashes of War, you'll need one of them later. So wait, you change your mind about Elden Ring? This is Sully. Uh, Soul Hythel? Yes, I did. This game's awesome. And I was wrong. How many... Ooh, we can level up. do I need? Like, 26? Something like that? Something like it. Aye. Something like that. Toast. Hit him with a furniture drive. I mean, so. What should I do next, Chad? What would be a good thing to do next? My armor got way upgraded. I upgraded my sword. I don't have a number six. What do you think about the game before? Says Alcrad. I uninstalled it three times without making it past the first boss. Gonna need a lot more vigor. Uh, will you be playing Hogwarts Legacy or is it too controversial? No, hey, no matter. I'm not a Harry Potter fan. How many do I need? Well, I mean, I am. I've read all the books. 27. Ooh. I think I've read all the books. I've read it when I was a kid, but I don't. I really don't care about the franchise. So I'm not gonna be playing Hogwarts Legacy just because I don't I don't care. <laughs> it's not on my radar. I showed my folks your Conqueror video. This is Rex Wrath. What'd they think of it? I have another assassination target. Target. How do I get the mimic tier? That's what I want. I know they nerfed it, but I know it's still strong as Shinola. Knight of Blood. I don't have... I don't think I have the mount. I don't have that um, area. Yet. That's like... That's like... Yeah. <laughs> that's way over there. I don't got that. You need to complete Ronnie's quest? My dad shares your vids around. Nice. Glad you got over the hump and enjoying the game. I am. Which I do. So I so that, that's that's the end of their quest line for now, because I I don't want to go all the way there and blah, 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 blah. Um Okay, Werns, I'm down. I'm in um I have stuff for there. Wait. 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 Right? This is it? Yeah. Have you found or tried the Great Jar, jar Challenge yet? It rewards a nice talisman. This is Bryce with a five. No, I haven't. Need to kill Radon first? Have you beat Radon? No, I haven't. Should I go try doing that? You're better and more patient man than me tracking this game. I love watching it on your stream. It says, Mahmoud. Hey. Welcome. Get in here. It's that Castle Redmayne. Got it! Chat, in just a couple of minutes, we're going to take a short break to stretch, to... to excrete. <laughs> and then we'll be back with more. I want this mappy map. 60 Vigor is a soft cap. That's step one for the mimic. Got it, 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 got it. Chat, why'd you do this sim? I am aware that Radon is extremely difficult. I am aware. You're not doing anything to me by telling me to fight him. I'm aware. I will attempt to first locate him. Right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Damn! <laughs> Where the heck am I going? Bloodborne is awesome, Rex. I love Bloodborne. Look at the size of that boy. So much poop. Dang. 
How do I get where I'm going? Kyle pronounced my name perfectly. That's how it's done. It says Mahmoud. Yeah. See, chat, I'm of the opinion. You know, like when people have a difficult to pronounce name and they give you an easier to pronounce name and they're like, uh, no, don't worry, you know, my name's X, but you can just call me Chris. That's, uh, it's, it's disrespectful, right? Just because their name is hard to say doesn't mean you shouldn't learn it. Put some respect on their name, literally. Say their name. What, you can't make the effort to learn a name? That's stupid. Chad, I'm just... Oh, they they explode. Cool. Uh, don't get don't get motion sick, Chat. I just need my need my Roonies, my Rooney tunes, real quick. Uh oh, Scarlet Run. Ah! My eyes. Ugh, this hurts me. Ah! I am getting dizzy. How is it for you? Kyle can't say my name right, guaranteed. Says Dahual Sagal. Dahual Sagal? Hmm? I've never fought one of these dogs before. I think one killed me. Tyrannosaurus Rex? Haha! <laughs> because that's a common name for a dog? Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> Gosh. Don't be behind me. Don't be behind me. Don't be behind me. Hey. Okay. What are you doing? Now try another name. It's Irish. Uh, any Gaelic name, you know it's a, it's a, it's a trap. 27,000. Damn it. I don't want to fight these dogs. I... am just going ahead and assuming they're difficult. Okay, close enough. Pronounce my first name as Dahual, maybe. That's what I did! Or just Dahual? I did! What a coincidence, I just started as a, a new Elden Ring playthrough as a Flame Faith Monk. It says Matterbeam. OG. Zappy Dragon's ahead! It says two and four. I forget what I'm referencing, but I've been saying to out loud to myself a lot. Tis I that slate the dragon. I don't know why I've been saying that. There's a dragon head. Is it the big sleeping one? Where? Ooh, everything just got quiet. Is it dragon time? There you are. Is that two dragons? How am I gonna fight two dragons? Oh, it is a dragon burrow. Got it. Got it. Okay, we need 2,000 runes. Oh, it's Tenacious D. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kyle, can you do a backflip in IRL? Says uh, Mick Boogers. Yes, I can. I learned two summers ago on my dad's yacht. <laughs> Took us a little while, but we figured it out. What am I doing? Tis I that slate the track. It's it's that Jack Black style of talking that I really enjoy. All right, let's see how difficult these. Let's isolate one of them, huh? Too many. Too many. Oh, jeez. That's cool. I mean, terrifying, but also cool. Oh, yeah. Here goes. Tis I! The slate! Ah! Jeez. Calm down, dude. 
This sword is sick with it, as the kids say. It's not Slade the dragon? Slain? No, Slade. Where hyena? Got it. God bless America. How do I keep forgetting what that number is? Michael Skinner, welcome. Jack Black is a treasure who needs to be protected. Import that sword and escape for Tarkov. No, you'd, you'd be head-eyed from across the map instantaneously. Too slow. My poise is too high, doggo! Oh, come on. <laughs> that, that, like, ground jaw move is pretty cool. I'll give it to him. If I just stay underneath your tiny arms... Yes! 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 Now, if this is enough runes, runes, I'm going to shut down the stream. Yeah, the mouth shovel thing is pretty cool. Galaxy Warrior, thank you for joining us. Love the videos. They're probably more... Oh. You weren't complimenting me. <laughs> That's what I was interested in. Tis I! That's Slate, the track. Ooh, just enough chat. You're lucky. Um, everyone was telling me, buff that vigor, so that's what we're going to do next. <laughs> that's what we're going to do next. <laughs> chat. Chat. We have reached the halfway point. Wow, your build is awesome. Breaking those dog stance on horseback. Look, I'm just... I'm full into dex. I'm on 31 dexterity, 28 strength. I am swinging with this sword. Oh, I'm at level nice. Nice. Chat, we're halfway through our Science and Elden Ring excursion where I have been converted to Team Elden Ring. It's a great game. We're not going to uninstall it. We got to beat it. We got to beat it. Alex, thanks for being here. Thanks for joining becoming a facility gamer today. Chat, I want you... I just did get more vigor. Leo. Chat, uh, Buster, how many how many science lessons we do? Uh, chat, I want you to take the next couple of minutes, two, three minutes, stretch, get a drink of water, excrete whatever... what you need to, you need to get out of you. Count sends at seven at halftime. That's, I mean, come on. We're almost at 140 minutes, which is divided by seven. One science lesson every 20 minutes. That's better than school. Chat. Do whatever you got to do. I'm going to do whatever I got to do. We'll be back in a couple minutes for the second half of Scientist Plays Elden Ring. Don't go anywhere, because if you do, you don't want to.
is I who slayed the dragon. Chat. What am I hearing? Oh, right. The game. <laughs> it's like, why is it raining in my ears? Chat, welcome back. Let me... How do I do away with this? That's fine. Hell of an entrance. Woo! Everyone done excreting? I am. And just remember, chat, I want the Mimic tier, and I want the cool Siamese twin armor. So, our next goal is to defeat the third technically optional, optional, but main, main big boss, Radon. So that's what we're going to do. How's everyone doing so far? It's not slayed the dragon. It's laid the dragon? Tis I who laid the dragon. Like that? We just leveled up. Let's check out our... Let's check out our... Oh, yeah, no, I've seen the fight. It looks awesome. Let's see what our, uh, our stats and everything's looking like, huh? So we're level 69. Nice. We're high on dex, strength, vigor. Make sure to do it during the daytime. Okay. I know it's too early to say, but uh, after Elden Ring, would you play a Ragnarok? Well, I recently... Well, I 100% a Ragnarok. I think it's a phenomenal game. Not many games better acted than that. Um, but it's not on PC. And I don't want to go through the hassle of hooking up my PS5 to the machine here in the Gaming Command Center. I would play it. It's really, really good. And I really enjoyed it. It's really, really good. So, chat. Um, we're still looking out for science times. Donkey POV. This is Age Templar. I'm not even, I don't even know what that means. Age. Hey, here's a cool little shot. We, we just ended up with a cool little shot, huh? So, what I was trying to do... Oh, yeah, I got the map. Leveled up. We're going to take that out. Uh, which means we're going to go to Castle Eddie Redmayne. <laughs> and we are going to... Wherever he is. I don't know where he is. Donkey from Shrek. is it, He's the one that says, Tis I who laid the dragon? Donkey says that? Jack Black doesn't say that? Man, I'm... I'm all... I'm all kinds of confused. Man, the level design is just cool. Hey, there's Blade. I think. Would you like to eat dinner in this medieval-themed TGI Fridays? <laughs> oh, except for the burning people. Ignore that. Look at the size of this guy. This guy's like six foot eight. Thirty-seven inch vertical leap. Are double jumps possible? Like the ones Torn performs in game? Is the wall Segal? No. And I'm not going. I'm not going to elaborate too heavy on heavily on that because we do that in every single game that we play. The plays are all made up. I'm waiting for the good. Let's give them a show to remember, eh? Just don't you go dying on me. For Ronnie's sake, too. Yeah, I want. <laughs> Tis I who laid the Ronnie. Into the fray together. <laughs> oh, so the guy's just here? Or Don's just past that? Don't you get teleported to a. whatever. This place sounds like Halo. Hey, what are you... Oh, okay. Champions! Wait, what? Welcome Wait, what is this? What am I doing? The stars have aligned. The best 
Constable is Who's nigh. talking? Oh. General Radon, mightiest demigod oh. of the Shattering awaits you. Champions, prepare for battle. Kyle, your favorite educational content creator, thank you for being able to explain things in a simple fashion, says T-Bone. You're welcome. Do you participate in the Coliseum, or are you not into it? It says, Jorge Moreno. Jorge Moreno. Um, this is my first time playing the game. I, I haven't even beaten the game yet. So, no. Hey. Hello, Jarman. Ah, indeed, I thought I might find you here. From where do you speaketh? It a thing. I could face a But... You can't quiver. You're too ceramic. assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking. Be sure to get a good vantage, my friend. Leo, I, just remember get I the bull goat talisman and get your vigor up to 60. Hereby vow to a... I mean, it's pretty... Okay, sure. Is no one gonna join me, or are you guys just gonna... Okay. Would a pot person be like a hermit crab? Says two and four. Yeah, I imagine he's in there puppeting it. Who was talking to me? Oh, this is the guy from the uh, intro scenes, huh? Are you good and prepared, young chum? I don't like the, the way festival. that sounds. Right. Before we begin, allow me to paint you the full picture. Chef Julia, thanks for being here. Going back to a master's in gastronomy, emphasis on cultural anthropology, the facility and the facility discord conversations gave me the final push. Thank you, Julie. You're the best. You honor me. General Radan is cursed ever to wander. Eaten from the inside by Melania's scarlet rot, his wits are long gone. You need a bigger horse. Now he gathers the corpses what? of former friends and foes alike, what? gorging on them like a dog. Howling at the sky. I know the intro of this fight's pretty freaking sick. We must make merry. Oh, gathering of champions! The rebels! Begin. Like when you approach him, I think it's pretty the epic. Like he shoots arrows at you and, and like war. lightning and stuff. The Radon Festival! Ow! I mean, who are you talking to, dude? Just Potman? Tis I who slayed Radon. You stabbed that guy? No. He didn't do anything to me. Do I have to go back out the door? Halo 2 soundtrack was pretty good if I do say so myself oh it's behind there got it pause how you are did you know that Steve Vai did all the guitar work for Halo 2 and that's why it's so awesome Jorge ooh smithing stone I can update. I can upgrade my guy. Use your NPCs as meat shields because he's gonna try to one-shot you with an arrow. Got it. Couldn't he just like come up this lit? Cortana is pretty, but Arya is way cuter. So you could definitely kick Cortana's ass. Oh, he can't fit his big butt in his tiny horse at this little teleporting hole. I mean, just look, just look at the, the visuals of this. And the fact that you can literally go anywhere you can see. It's pretty sick. Let's fight him! Daytime fight is way cooler? Why? What's the difference? What's the difference? If I remember correctly, it took Doc two full streams to beat this guy. Doc isn't a um, 
he doesn't really understand single player game language and mechanics too well so he'll often throw himself at stuff without leveling up without doing different tactics etc etc so he's much better at multiplayer there's no difference it just looks different it's red how far away am i from the okay you guys said you guys said specifically make sure it's daytime okay all right go back to eddie redman castle pass the time Good morning. You can summon a lot of NPC friends in the boss area. Got it. Um, uh, do I go to signs on the ground? First? There's no limit for summons in this one. Oh. Well, how do I... Do I just have to keep cycling through ashes? I don't want to do that. Yes, yeah, some of them in the fight. Who? Do I touch them underground? There's summon signs. There's summons on the ground. And I have to do that while I'm getting attacked? Chat, where, where the hell am I going? You, where, where did I go, chat? I already... They're spoiling the fight. Just do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Where the hell am I going? Wait, what is happening? I know. Why can't I... Couldn't I go out there before? Oh, do I have to talk to this guy? Maybe I'm getting... Blocked? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Are you good yep, 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 yep. Before we begin... But now... It makes it you... nighttime, chat. Chad, you are so dumb. <sighs> Maybe it's because the first time it's the first time I'm I'm fighting Radon, so it might be this is how you do the first one, and if you die, you can do whatever. Um, but. I just want to make it very clear that you just wasted minutes of my life. Two and four, it's fine. I don't blame you specifically. I just blame you. A little. <coughs> Do I have to go through the portal, or do I go through the... Why do I keep asking chat things? I'll just try it. Boop. You can only fight him at daytime through a glitch. Oh my gosh, you guys. Uh-oh. Arrow incoming? <laughs> I pressed dodge. Shut up. Okay, 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 okay. Where are the NPC, uh... Summon cells? I don't see it. Are those summon signs? Oh, oh, they are. Oh, yeah, 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 summon. Yeah, 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 summon all. Yeah, 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 come on. Let's go. I get all these guys, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's do it. More. Yes. More. Yes. 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 Casual greeting. Get casual greeting in here. Perfect. Sick. 96 damage. Cool. Ooh, he is big. Oh, he's 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 toes, Chad. He's gonna be toes. Yes! Come on, big boy! Is there any more? Did I miss some summons? Oh, people are just dying, got it. Chat, my sword is... Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Love 
dreadlocks. Uh-oh. Where are you going? Uh... Phase two? What? <laughs> what? Chat, I'm not looking at you for a second. Whoa! Kind of getting close, but he's too... He's too deadly to be left alive! Jeez. Alright, my, uh... What? 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 Nope. Respawn summon? All said that. Oh yeah, I can do it. I can do it. Alright. No, no, no. Nope. 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 <laughs> Perfect dodge. Perfect dodge. Didn't even try. Get on! Yes! Kidding me? That's it? That was the first try. That's first try. I got that. That's chat. That was a first try. You know it. You know it. I know it. Everyone knows it. That was a first try. That was a first try. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it! Come on. That attack is so cool. It just looks really cool. Sick. Let's <laughs> get this. How many NPCs are on this map? A lot, huh? Okay, how do I dodge this? How do I do how do I dodge this part? Where's he coming? Oh, I just dodged it, got it. Do 
Oh right, I'm streaming. I forgot. Just for, I mean, we got this chat. I'm just doing this for safety, you know. You know how it is. Are your feet? <laughs> Second try, come on. Come on. That was a cool fight. You made that look easy. You just gotta you just gotta look at the pet. That, the, the, the fact that you can summon, like, six other people to draw his attention from you. Ooh, cool. What's happening? Oh, this is how I get to Nokron? Not even hard. Mm -mm. Well, I was, I am level 69. Nice. I don't know what level you're supposed to be. That's seriously impressive? Alright. What did I just do? East Limgrave is where you want to go for the Mimic, says producer JS. <laughs> 70,000 thrones. Well, I have to be a decent level, huh? You dropped a meteor on the planet. Nice. Hey, did you make it, bro? Yeah, I'm just eating dirt. <laughs> oh yeah, the stars can move now, because Radon is dead. Kyle, you need so much vigor. Everyone calm down. I know what I'm doing at this point. So I'm gonna what I've been what I've been doing lately is we gotta up this and then this. I need, I need, I need, Chad, obviously what I'm doing is working. Woo! You did much better than I did on my first try. Woo! I mean, okay, now let's know where someone asks a science question so we, we can break number seven. Uh, this would be a good time for a science lesson. What happens when a meteor this size hits a planet? Go check Eastern Limgrave. Okay, if that's where I gotta go, that's where I gotta go. We'll, we'll check. We'll see how, we'll see how uh, big it is. Good. I was waiting for you. This guy's huge. What a sick way to fight, eh? That was pretty cool. The glory of the clash is shared by Radan and you. And huh, did you see that afterwards? Falling star right before our eyes. I can't fathom how Radan was holding back something at that scale. He was a living legend if ever I saw one. And the path has now been cleared. Chat, think about it. Rani's fate would be this. Let's meet where the falling star bit the We'll take up our souls once more. Okay. Um, Let's meet where the will go into my only purpose is to fight the curtains rising. Okay. Let's meet where we'll okay. go into my only purpose is Just the exhausting rising. the dialogue options, chat. Chat. A much easier way than holding all the stars in place would be to hold the planet in place so the stars didn't move in the sky. That would make more sense. Does the shape of a meteor have a big effect on the impact, or is it just speed and mass? No, the composition of a meteor is critical um, in determining what it actually... What the hell is that? Determining if it makes it to the ground and how much damage it does. Because um, a meteor can be a loose aggregation of rock, or it could be like solid iron. And you can imagine, one uh, would do a lot more damage than the other. Um, Actually, there's a fun approximation that uh, Sir Isaac Newton, kind of an incel, but really smart, um, 
Sir Isaac Newton came up with, which is when something is going really, 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 really fast, you can approximate the depth it will impact into something based on the ratio of the densities. So if the density of the thing hitting the other thing, if these two densities are roughly the same, it will bury itself about its own length. That's just what the ratio was when he uh, uncovered this empirical relationship or mathematical relationship. So um, the larger the density difference, the larger something will, the, the further something will go into something else as an impact. So if you take earth, which say, you know, take the density of, of earth and stone, you know, 3,000 kilograms per cubic meter or something like that, and then you compare it to the density of iron, which I don't know what that is. Um, iron's higher, and so since the ratio is higher, it will burrow further into its target. Um, so the composition of a meteor is critical in its impactfulness as an impactor. Man, it's like I'm a professional at this or something. Um, what, what are those things? Oh, that's just rocks. Sick. Guys, I just beat a guy who could hold the stars in place. You want to shoot those arrows at me? I did it first try. It was definitely first try. Iron is 7.8. Um, so that means it's, it's more than twice the density of, like, rock or stone, which is, like, 3,000 uh, or 3 grams per cubic centimeter, which means a, a solid iron meteor will impact more than twice its length into, um, into dirt and, and gravel and ground. So if this thing is, you know, a kilometer across, you know, getting close to, like, planet killer. Imagine something a kilometer long going two and a half kilometers deep as a crater. That would be... I mean, it could kill a continent easily. Where the hell am I going? East Limgrave. Where my little... My little, uh, semen trail is leading me. Perfect. Oh, it's leading me towards, like, an island, huh? Chat, don't ignore what I said, okay? Will I be able to see it from here? Wait, that's not Limgrave. Yeah, it is. Ignore what I said. Science time number nine, baby. Elijah, with the five, science question. Is it possible for the impact of a meteor, comet, etc. to happen without destroying the surrounding area? Um, depends on the size. Anything big enough to make it to the ground is going to have a large impact. Um, if it makes it to the ground intact. You're on the west side, not east. That's because I... There it is. You guys, I don't want to hear nothing about it. I'm bad with cardinal directions. What if it goes really, really slowly? It can't. It would be pulled, it would be accelerated by the planet's gravity, by the solar system's gravity. Um, everything in any kind of orbit. Whoa, whoa! Sick! Anything in any kind of orbit around a planet, the solar system is going dozens of kilometers per second like 25 kilometers per second and that's so quick that's so fast i'll give you i'll give you an example that i got from xkcd and it's even faster than this but i'll give you an example sick um comets asteroids everything like that move so quickly say j just a, at orbital velocity they move so quickly that if they were on a, if they moved past a football field and you were standing on the football field at the zero yard line and you fired a bullet at the same time the comet passed where you were, 
that comet would reach the end zone before the bullet reached the 10-yard line. That's how fast we're talking about. Science time. Okay, now how do I get to the impact site? Looks like that is the pathway. Jeez, Kyle, you're so good at Elden Ring. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, Jaden Booth, yeah, you're, you're describing, I was describing the ISS example, exactly. You're so smart, Jaden. Look, our our our, uh, our goal is to get the mimic tier at the moment because I know it's super strong and I want it. What? Okay. Uh. 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 Yeah, H Templar. When you what a lot of people don't know is that um, that's ruining my view. When you uh, train to become a science communicator, they they uh, like doing your arithmetic arithmetic tables. You learn very quickly how to compare everything to blue whales or football fields. It's the two main metrics of science communication. Look into the abyss or into the abyss. Do I have to jump in? What say you, random guy? Try jumping. Mm. Let's see what this bloodstain had to say about it. Let's see if you're a liar. Liars. The traitor's the old blacksmith. Go say hello to him. First thing I read, let's do it. Oh yeah, thing I can talk to new people now since I killed Radan. I loved your Sonic Black Hole, says Michael Skinner. That was one of the first videos on the new channel. Let's see what these fingies have to say. What's the biggest a marine animal could get on Earth? Uh, blue whale. Ah, you have returned. I found your eyes. <laughs> Just kidding. can buy his armor and his stuff. That is so many runes, though. Is it better than what I have on? Chat, should I get Radon's armor? Are they good? Or Eddie Redmayne's helm? Are they good? No, I know the... Is it great? Okay. Not that blacksmith, the giant blacksmith. I thought he was good. Most of is not bigger? No. Some of the best in the game, but super heavy. Well, my endurance is pretty high. Okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Would you want a new species named after you, regardless of the animals, says Dark Jester? Yes. I want this guy's armor, but I don't know how to get it. Okay. Uh, Carrion Mansion. Carrion Mansion. Carrion Mansion. Carrion Mansion. Carrion Mansion. Carrion Mansion. This is Bukaria. This is that lady. This is here. No, he's like he's here. No, he's like here. No, he's like here. There he is. Is size restrict? Why is there a why is there a limit? Are you basically not weightless in water? You're not weightless in water, no. You still have weight in water, just less. You are buoyant. In water, you are buoyant in proportion to the volume of fluid that you displace. So you can be heavier than the buoyant force. And so that rest that still requires muscles to keep you afloat, etc., uh, etc. Et um, and like the breathing problem, there's also like a heating problem to keep your whole body that hot. You need extra, you need you need exponentially more muscles and more blubber and all this sorts of things. So there is a size limit 
somewhere. Nick Lynn, I love the idea of a Kyle Hill beetle. Did you know that most animals on Earth are beetles? In terms of species, not in terms of raw numbers. But most species on Earth are beetle. If you put all species of beetle on Earth, if you put all species on Earth into a bag, a big bag, you know, like, not like Noah's Ark, because that'd be way too small and it's totally ridiculous, but put all the species on Earth into a big bag. It would be roughly, I actually did this math, for an episode that will come out sometime. The bag will be roughly a sphere about six kilometers in diameter. You'll find out eventually. If you reached in and grabbed out a random species, it's likely to be either a, a wasp or a beetle. Buster Sharp, that was two science times back to back. What am I doing? I forgot. Oh yeah, Ichi. Hey, you traitor. Why are you a traitor? I don't know. Let's find out. Ah. You finally come. You've defeated General Radan, unlocking the stars. The General was blighted by Scarlet Rot and driven to madness. But not long ago, there is no parallel to your achievement. Nor to Lady Rani's acute judgment. I'll walk your big soul, Carl. Thanks to you. Lady Rani's fate once again stirs, and the descend underground where the fallen star struck Limgrave and make it yours. The precious treasure of Nokron. I thought this guy was bad. has been given an important task. Apparently, a matter of... What blade was the bad? In fact, he is quite good. That's what I thought, right? You need not await. Descend underground and make it yours so that Lady Rani may... I already, um... You need I already went into the, far, the so forlorn Lady... ever gaul. Do I need to go there? You're making me want to play this game, says Austin. It's great. It's great. I uninstalled it three times. I'm not going to uninstall it a fourth until I beat it to open up space. Okay, okay, everyone. Look, we have Necron. We're close to our goal. We still have an hour to play. Don't worry. But everyone is being a little pushy right now. That is here. Bam. Gaul is pronounced jail, by the way. I don't believe you. It's an ever, it's an, uh, it's an ever Gaul. This, so chat, we're up to 24 deaths on stream. And this is where I got 19 of them. Because of you. Go there, then back to Ichi. All right. Don't I have to have the snap emoji or something? Is he in there? Doesn't sound like he's in there. Oh, it's you. What? It's me. Bye. Where? Old EG trapped me here. Oh. Told me I'd bring north, but failed to lady Rod. There's no chance I could have. I'm part of a big. I thought old EG knew, honestly. I don't know what's going on anymore. What do I do? Most wasp species are the non-stinging or barely recognizable as a wasp kind, says Jaden Booth. Yeah, I think most of them are are uh, are uh, paras uh, parasitic. Do it. Open it. I like Blade's armor, but that means you have to kill him, right? I I'm pl I'm 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 trying to be a good guy in this first playthrough here. Kyle, do you have a schedule for your stream, or is it random? Uh, it's kind of random right now. Because this is this is our side hustle at the moment. We're trying to grow the gaming channel, trying to build out this section of the facility that takes a lot of drywall, 
mainly we're focusing on writing Half-Life histories, recording new videos, that kind of thing. So, sorry that it's not more consistent right now. It's sad either way. Okay. You sold me. My thanks, friend. I'm going to see Mr. Shrott. I don't know what came over Oli. But even if the odds are slim, no. Not a fight against her fate, she's true. Do you know what I like? I like talking to NPCs traveling back and forth between fast travel points. That is extremely my shit. He's a furry question mark? No, I think he's like I think he's actually a half wolf man. Hey, hey, you know that guy you imprisoned? I let him out. Is that okay? Greetings, my friend. I presume you've very well. The two fingers gave blithe to Lady Rani as a faithful follower. Her very shadow, but if Lady Rani, as an Imperian, resists being in the shadow, will go mad. Transforming from a follower into a... How long have you been live since Veilside? Uh... Such is his destiny. Two and a half in hours? such matters, Blythe's own thoughts hold no weight. Veilside, can you, can you try the command uh, exclamation point uptime? But he must See if that works. Neutralized. For Lady Rani's sake. Wait, but why? But like, what if Lady Rani wants to be follow the the destiny, and then she doesn't have to? How? What if that's like? I wasn't listening. I was looking at chat. Did the uptime work for you guys? Oh wait, do I go back to the tower? <laughs> Dark Jester with the 10, lycanthropy, can you, uh... Uptime broken? Uh-oh. Oh, okay guys, stop. <laughs> guys, stop! All Empyreans were given a wolf companion from the Two Fingers and meant they were control of the Empyreans. Ronnie's whole deal is trying to kill the Two Fingers, so I think... So, Ichi thinks that Blade will be bad. Guys, stop. No more. No more uptime. They're just gonna keep spamming it. Stop it! <laughs> I have to go disable that. I have to disable... If you guys aren't gonna be cool, I have to disable it. One second, you very cool people. Okay. Chat is broken. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I got it. 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 I mean, it says it's working. Uptime is one word. Anyway, I, I disabled it. Um, okay. So, why does Ronnie want to kill the Two Fingers? So she can make her own destiny not related to the Elden Ring? Is that the idea? Like the video. Okay, now do I go into the area? Oh, precisely, I nailed it. Oh god, I'm so intuitive. My reading comprehension skills. My reading comprehension skills have always been incredible. Ronnie wants to farm all her Sims. Oops. I mean, who doesn't? What do you think I'm doing right now? <laughs> think of the two fingers as a religious head. It's just a matter of difference in opinion. They each have a way the world should be run, and they differ enormously. Oh, like Catholics and Protestants. Lycanthropy, right, Dark Gesture. Um, I made a video about 
lycanthropy back on Because Science, and I basically said I don't super get it because the light from the moon is just reflected sunlight. Um, it has its own, you know, spectrum. It has its own spectrum that you can identify moonlight is and its own intensity, but it, there's nothing different. Um, and actually, uh, one time, uh, I think in Texas, Bill Nye got booed for saying that moonlight is just sunlight reflected, and they're like, No, it ain't. Anyway. Do I go down here? Too late. Yep. Uh, Praise the pickle. See, this is why I turn off multiplayer. Please tell me you're joking. No. I'm not joking. That seems too far. Is that too far? If you could remove the mist, that'd be sick. This is why you turn on multiplayer. Alright, oh, let's see. Here, I'm gonna pick a random... This, let's pick the one on the right. First off, message. But likely whole. Quality. Damn, imagine if werewolves were always turning into monsters in the day. Exactly. Same thing for vampires. But I suppose you could make vampires work by saying they only react to a certain density, uh, intensity, rather, of sunlight um, with a certain spectrum of UVA, UVB. You know, if I was writing something, you know, that's what I would do. But, you know, I'm not Diablo Cody. Is that who wrote Twilight? The message is to save my life a couple times, taken it a few times, and made me laugh regardless. Tis I who slayed the hole. Chat? Thoughts? So I guess the city was lost, and it took a meteor impact to get all the way down here, huh? That grease is soporific! Vampires could be like the volatiles from dying lights, is Vane sick. Who, yeah, it, who you keep them away with UV, uh, UV radiation. I like those. Damn. Cool. Ah, Elden Ring. Hey, that's what I just said. Alright, fine, I'll leave the messages on. Pretty insightful. Except they're frickin' everywhere. They're like visual spam. Wow, I think I just described a lot of the internet. Can the same principle of spectrum explain lycanthropy? Sure. Look, I don't make... This is a hard jump. I don't like that jump. I like this jump. I was going to die on that jump. Look up, please. What? Where? What? What's so cool up there? Liar. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a mimic tier. That's where I'm. That's what I want. Gimme, give gimme. Give I want to fight a version of myself, but when I go into the area, I'm going to take off all of my clothes and get naked, so that it makes a version of myself that's naked. And then I'm going to put all my weapons back on, and then I'm going to annihilate them. God, that's so cool. The furry spectrum says ham straight. Yeah, there is. I could tell you about it since most of my followers are furries, but I'm not knowledgeable enough. Sorry, I was reading chat. Yep. Mimic this. Yoink. Yoink. Mimic this. I just noticed that there's an there's a different attack after a dodge. Like, this is the normal fast attack, but if you dodge and then spin, like in the other direction, you get that nice little... God, this game's so good. I mean, just like... Like, we are just in an open area, and then there's like dozens of fully thought out, gigantic, impressive 
areas to go and explore. Like, everywhere you turn, I'll be watching you. But every move you make, I'll be... Uh, but there's just so much. It's so dense. And I'm sure once I beat the game, there'll be a dozen things that I didn't even see. It's kind of reminding me of Living Mercury. Um... My, uh, the, fir I, the first time I really remember being amazed about something science-y, I remember the exact moment, Chad. The moment I was sitting in, um, Mr. D's 8th grade science class. What? I'm trying to beat Wholesome! Ah! I was sitting in Mr. D's 8th grade science class and he passed around a mile of a vial of mercury, and since it's 14.3 grams per cubic centimeter instead of one gram per cubic centimeter, the vial was deceptively heavy, ex exceedingly heavy for what we thought was just a normal liquid. And at that moment, I was like, damn, science is sick. Unfortunately, I never got to tell Mr. D the impact he really had on me because he got cancer at a young age and died before he could ever see me become a sciencey guy. So, uh, I will say, Chad, if you have, and don't, I'm not looking for compliments here, so don't do this, but if you have a science teacher, like a real teacher, in your life that has made an impact, tell them before you can't tell them. That's what I'll say. They'll appreciate it, surely. The other city, the city with all the stars and the, the underground city with all the stars in the area was prettier than this. I want some pretty stars. Yeah, any, any, any kind of teacher or mentor, or mentor, doesn't matter, doesn't have to be a science teacher. Just tell someone that, you know, they meant something. Well, time to look up an old email. Nick, you won't regret it, trust me. I mean, I had a lot of a lot of formative experiences in, in sciencey stuff and nerdery from, you know, playing a sing my one cherished dinosaur CD-ROM over and over and over again to going out and looking for bugs in my backyard or taking samples of pond water and looking for all the little microorganisms in a simple microscope. There's a lot of things that put me on my nerdy way, but that mercury one was definitely. A highlight. How do I get down here? Kia Kui says, Wait, what now? I'm a special ed teacher. What are we doing? We're just saying we appreciate you, man. How do I get down there? This is going to say try jumping. Oh. This is going to say try jumping. Let's see this guy. Oh, he's got... Whoa, what a... Yeah, see, he died. That's like Radon's... That guy looks sick. Can I hit something on the way down to arrest my momentum? Is Neil deGrasse Tyson, Tyson obnoxious? Uh, depends. Um, on Twitter, he's he's terrible on Twitter. He, he's really bad at using Twitter. Um, he's basically... On Twitter, he's basically, like, uh, wasting all the respect that he's gathered. When he's speaking live and doing an interview or doing a, a, you know, an appearance, he's still great. He's still a great communicator. He's still very smart. He's one of the best science communicators ever. But he can often be a dick and he's bad at Twitter. How do I get over here? Get on your horse, Kyle. Nope. I don't want to get you in trouble. That's fine. I, um... It's right here. Just drop here, chat. There's a there's a lot of things that Neil deGrasse Tyson does that I would not do. Um And you know, when I first started out doing all this, you know, science communication professionally, I would have never said anything like that, but now it's a <laughs> bye bye. I feel like I've I feel like I've proven myself <laughs> like I know what I'm doing. You know, I've been doing this professionally for almost ten years now. So I think my opinion is valid. 
or at least not not valid. Whoop. Bye bye. <laughs> yep. Hello. Yeah, his podcast is good. I'm not saying he's bad. I'm just saying there's things that he does that I would. Hope that Kyle makes it to the deep rope, deep root depths boss before the stream ends. I, I had so much trouble with that fight. You ever think bringing back Muskwatch with Dan Casey? No. Um, Elon Musk is... When we did Musk... Well, first of all, I can't do Muskwatch regardless because that's a nerdist property. Um, and I, I left that company. Um, but two, we stopped doing Muskwatch because it got unfun. And we started getting lawsuits against him and, you know... Uh, getting in trouble with the FTC and all these things a couple years ago and now he's he's just a loser he just seems like such a cringy loser um, and the more that comes out it's like he is successful despite himself like people at his companies have Elon I've, I, I've read that you know there's people at SpaceX that are basically like Elon handlers who know how to how to deflect his bad ideas and handle him so that engineers and stuff can actually get people who want to go to space can get their work done. So I, it's it doesn't sound, oh, it just wouldn't be fun, you know. And I'd want to have fun. That's why Dan and I did that show because it was fun. Look up. Ah. Okay, am I close to the mimic tier area? That's what I want. And then I want to level it up. Give me my horse. Sean Carroll. Uh, Dark Jester. Sean Carroll's a friend of mine. Very smart guy. Very smart guy. Dummy. Good communicator, too. The chair is about 15 minutes away. Ho! Oh. I was looking at chat. Chat, I just want to point out that I think in the last two hours, I've died once, and we beat Radon second try. What I'm saying is, I'm amazing at this game. And off stream, I will again grind, get to a crazy high level, and beat this game eventually. What about PBS Space Time? PBS Space Time is very good for people who... Uh, it's not... PBS Space Time is not uh, casual. The guy, you know, bless their hearts, the, the hosts that they hire are very, very smart people, um, but they talk very technically. And to me, it's PBS Space Time isn't as accessible as other shows. Um, and if I have one complaint, it's that when they talk about black holes or, or time or, or whatever, a lot of the times it's... They say concepts and ideas without really explaining them to people, like they know, like I'm supposed to know what we're talking about. So, not super accessible. And um, but you know, if you're already if you're a space enthusiast and you already know a lot about space and time and all that stuff, then great. Then it's it's good for you. But it's not an entry level show. Yeah, chat. No, it goes over my head too. You know, um, and I have a I have two degrees, you know, in science. So <laughs> it's it's fine for that. It depends on what you want. There, I mean, three blue, one brown. One of the best math channels on YouTube. Highly technical, and it's very successful because it's for people who are technical or want to be technical. Not me. I, I, I'm not an expert in anything, so I will never give you a video that feels like it's too hard on some topic like that. That's all. Different approaches. Different approaches to the same problem, chat. That's fine. PBS Space Time is perfect. He's very good. Yeah, he's very good. I don't like how they frame him for the, from the dick up. It's poor producers. No one looks good from the dick up in a shot. Don't do that to your hosts. 
But he's a PhD astrophysicist, isn't he? I mean, he's, he's great. Yeah, three blue, one brown makes incredibly difficult math feel accessible. And that's, that's very hard to do. But it's also still inaccessible, unless you have, like, a math degree. Chat, where the hell am I going? I want to fight a naked version of myself. Do I have the map for this place? Huh. Wait. Yeah, I've already been here, chat! Yeah, I've been here, man! There's only one path forward. Is it here? Looks like it's there. Give me a horse if you're going to make the area this big, man. No, you're in the upper portion. I don't know, dude. I just got here, says Tremaine. All right, jeez. That's a hole. Let's go inside. No, it's not. Jebated. I don't even know what that means. Chat, where am I? Oh, in there? Yes, Rex, phrasing. That was the chip. Can the wavelength of light get smaller than a plank length via extreme blue shift? No idea. Um, I think plank length is defined as nothing can get shorter than it. So, by definition, no. It's like, what, times 10 to the negative 34 meters? You know? That's like almost five nanometer five times over. Something like that. <laughs> that attack is freaking sick. All right, all right, I get it. Where am I going, chat? When you come back out, turn right. Oh, there's only one path. All right, all right. Guys, guys, I really don't. You're beneath me. I thought planking was dangerous. <laughs> He decided not to uninstall, so I believe he's loving it. I am loving it. It's different. Oh. <laughs> Probably should have read the message. Um, it's different playing on stream, because I'm trying to science time and be entertaining. But at night, I have, uh, you know, I, get, I grab myself a White Claw, and I grind, and I enjoy it a lot. First off, beautiful. Nice. This place is sick. I like how they made... Like, the star with the, like, the Colosseum Greek kind of inspired. Never had a White Claw? Recommend it. Hey, you look dangerous. You want to dance? Monkey! Hit. Ooh, you have a whip. Cool. Hit. Give me your stuff. I know, I know you go to the Coliseum thing. You go everywhere. I mean, that's why the game is so cool. Okay, that's that's Mimic Tier, right? I think it is. Um, bioluminescent flora or fauna could be um, silkworms. Ah! Do silkworms? Yeah, they're the glowy ones, right? I believe so. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Is the uh, big blood boy in, in here? Is the big blood boy blocks in here? Now chat. Now chat, I'm pretty sure this is gonna work. But if I if it doesn't work, I'm gonna look stupid. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is gonna work. Maybe I did it too fast. Wait. <laughs> I 
Die, you idiot! <laughs> oh, you got rocks? Oh, that's so nice! Good for you! <laughs> oh, you are so foolish, me! <laughs> oh, did literally zero damage. Cool. <laughs> I'm the smartest man in the world. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you idiot. I bet I bet that's what it says on the floor too. Um where do I get do I Do I automatically have that chat? You get Ashes is some of the mimics here in an optional area attached to the neck, since I know you're going to ask as worms. I was going to ask. Where is it? <laughs> That's exactly what I was going to ask. Onward! God, I'm so smart. Horse? You have to go further into Nukron. Got it. I hear poop. Oh, there it is. Do I hear the sound of poop? Ooh, I need that one, I think. Gotta jump off for the night. Have a great rest of your evening, Kyle and Jack. Crispy, thank you for being here. I'll see you in the Discord. Chat, if you want to join our professors-only Discord and chat with me, ping me at any hour of the day, as many of you do. Do you want to level your summon first? No, I want the tier so I can level that up. Patreon.com slash Kyle Hill to join the Discord, get videos early, get bloopy bloops. Get behind the scenes photos and videos. Ah, uh, come on, come on, come on. It, look at that. I mean, look at Bucket. Look at Bucket doing that. Where do I go? Where do I go? Chat, last... Last, uh, Thanksgiving, we even had facility members going, cooking, and giving food to other facility members. It was lovely. Oh, I hate these guys. They have the, they have the long shot arrows. They'll just come in from nowhere. I'm going to my first college party in 20 minutes, says Max. Max, good luck. I don't know what your goals are for the party. And I would give you some advice, but I've never been to a college party. When I was in engineering school, I had one goal, and that was to get a three above a 3.5. <laughs> Max. No, no, you can you can unhide that tactical. Drink white claws and get laid. That's my goal. <laughs> All right, buddy. Be safe. For God's sakes, be safe. Drink responsibly. Enthusiastic consent. Just don't be don't be weird. I'm sure you'll do fine. But I had um yeah, I had one goal in engineering school. That said, my dad will buy me a car if I finish engineering school above a 3.85 GPA. So what I did was I didn't go to a single party. I went to only early classes, and I sat at the front of every class. And I got a 3.85 GPA. And I never went to a single college party, Chad. Mostly what I did was rock climbing. At that time, I was like rock climbing three to five times a week, so I didn't have time. Um, and then I went to graduate school and I got a 4.0. Not bragging, it's just facts. Okay, where's the, where's the larval tier? Where is it? I don't like these guys, so we're gonna have to be fast. Uh, her name is Aria. I'm also in engineering schools. It says Max, uh-oh. Uh-oh, dude. So you're already in a... You're in a situation. Jesus! Uh, okay, okay.
I was trying to give Max life advice. No, I already lit, lit all the pillars, Elijah. I can go fight the moose if I want to. I had 33,000 runes on my body. I gotta go pick that crap up. Yeah, I got stun lock. Yeah, that was cheap. Also, I was trying to give incredible advice to Max Maximus. Yeah, you're you're not in a high you're not in a good ratio environment. I think if we're talking about, you know, forming relationships, I think my engineering class had four women in it. Out of like a hundred, I think, something like that. Give me my runes. Get out of my face. Where's the tear? Chat. Wait, I've already been here, man. Are there two hollow horn grounds? Oh, there's an upper and a lower, huh? You have to light the pillars a second time up here. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Also, the mimic tier is on the left side of the area between two cliffs. Drop down onto a building. And do all of it while getting shot. Is it down here? Is it down there? Is that where it is? Don't do this fight if you haven't done the first. I haven't done the first. Yeah, I was waiting. Ah! I was maybe going to do the first deer fight with you guys because it's very beautiful. No, no. Left of where you enter. Got it. I hate those guys. Okay, so I drop down here. There's a lower and an upper necron. That guy, I see you. Yeah, just stay right there. Yeah, just stay right there. Yeah, just stay right there. It's near a bonfire. Got it. Uh, this is to the left. Hug the left cliff. Got it. Uh, Jaden, I think I will play this next week or in the next few days um, until Dead Space comes out, and then I gotta play that. I gotta play a little. I don't know if I'm gonna play it on stream. We'll see. Keep going. Got it. That's not creepy at all. Chat, we might time this perfectly. Okay. Parkour these rooftops. Got it. Be wary of hole. Always am. Max, that's another... <laughs> that's another uh, advice for your party tonight. Okay. Water slide? What? Ooh, I almost died. Knight's Sacred Ground. Do I jump down there? Dead Space Remake is next Friday? Oh, yeah, it is. Too late. You're a rejuvenating bolus. You're a bolus of Citadel. <laughs> I haven't seen Ke Elden Ring before, so this is a first. It's Kenneth. Kenneth, it's an extremely expansive game. I can now say I think I recommend it. It is all. It is also very difficult, though. So just keep going. All right. All right. Lots of people dying on this jump chat. See that? Ah, I made it onto the hole. Why did they? Why did that guy die? Oh, he just walked off like an idiot. Chat, we're coming up to the end. And hey, 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 lady. Yes, that move is awesome. Zero hits. Um chat we're coming up near the end of the stream if you haven't done so already please like the stream now as your civic duty to the facility no uh veil side there's so much in this game every you turn around and there's something new to do or something to gawk at or i mean it's really really good yeah kyle i didn't know that i was a i had a civic duty to the facility it's true you have a passport. That means you gotta like the stream. Where is it? Oh, probably down there. In a risky fashion. What is all this crap? 
get me the best summons in the game so I can continue on. Yeah, I can't drop down there yet, because I will die. Look left. You look left. Like this way? Like down in here? Too late. Give me that larval poop. I hear fancy stuff. This looks like I could get ambushed right here. Nope. Come on, come here, come here. Come here. Where is it? Chat, it's the only thing that I want in life. Do I have to do I have to use a sword storm key? Do I have a sword storm key? I think I do, but that's not him, right? Do I go in here? Ah, I better have a key, chat, or this is going to be really annoying to me. Where is this precious? You have something and really wants it. I think. Hey, so uh, are you going to fight me? Because you look kind of sexy. Oh, go ahead. Oh, can't fight in there. Can't. Buttons not working? Okay. Yeah, come out here. Come out here. Whoa, okay. Come out here. Come out here where it's safe. Cool move. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, Nick, you didn't. Yeah, yeah, Nick, you didn't know that I have a perfect golem impression? Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. Mission accomplished. Chat. We did it. Fat stupid harvesters. Give it to us, rubber and fresh. Chat. Like I said, I was wrong about Elden Ring. I was wrong. It is a fantastic game. I'm not going to uninstall it. We had 18 science times for a fantasy game. Kyle, how do you even manage it? It's because that's what we do here at the facility. If you're enjoying what we're doing here, please like the video. We have a lot more gaming and science to come. We have video videos about Dead Space. We'll be playing Atomic Heart next month. We'll be playing more Elden Ring, I'm sure of it. Thoughts on Cyberpunk? Totally turned around, too. That game was unplayable when it came out, and now it's great. Chat, I don't know what you're going to do tonight. Unless you're Max, I know what you're doing tonight. Stay safe, buddy. But chat, if you want more science, head back to the main channel, like and subscribe there. We have a brand new Half-Life Histories that I'm very proud of. If you want to check that out and need to catch up on some sciencey stuff. Otherwise, keep it locked here at the facility. Join at patreon.com slash Kyle Hill to get behind the scenes photos and videos. Videos early. You can talk with me every second of every day on Discord. I hear that we have one of the nerdiest, nicest discords on the internet. If you want to join us there, I hope you will. I hope you'll have you have a wonderful rest of your day, night, evening, morning, dusk, midnight, after tomorrow. That's not a word. Shut up. Until I see you next time, wherever that is, if it's in the facility proper, if it's the next gaming stream, the next office hours, which we will have next week, the next gaming short. What's that? hope until that time your life treats you fantastically and remember be nice to each other because at the end of the day this is all we do <laughs> <laughs>